But right now at 6, we begin with a wild video sent to ABC 13. Deputies chasing a Range Rover through the Cypress Lakes Golf Course in Northwest Harris County. And when it was over, the driver allegedly spit on a precinct for deputy. And tonight, two men are now facing charges. ABC 13, Micah Hatfield joins us live with the story. And Micah, you found out the deputies located the passenger in his swimming pool. This was an extremely odd series of events. Admittedly, I don't know much about golf, but I feel pretty confident you're supposed to drive balls on the course and not cars. Let's break down what happened. As I see them come over the hillside, I know they're on the golf course. You tee off, look down course quickly. Your focus shifts from where your ball went to the Range Rover bouncing over the hills on the Cypress Lakes golf course. What's going on? And then I saw a police car and I mean, it was like being in Grand Theft Auto. Um, it was kind of extreme. 20 year old Gray Martinez apparently wouldn't stop that Range Rover Tuesday morning when a deputy tried to pull him over. That's according to Precinct 4. He and his passenger, 19 year old Trevor Passmore, crashed out in the Fairfield subdivision. Somehow, Passmore ended up in his pool, according to sources, and that's where he was captured. Notice his pineapple swim shorts. Sources also say Martinez threw out an AK-47 in someone's front yard before he was taken into custody. I'm just glad nobody got hurt because there was a lot of people on the golf course, so that could have ended in a terrible way. Maybe you call it a coincidence, but Martinez was due in court that same morning for an evading case he caught back in December. Sources tell ABC 13 that he ran from another precinct 4 deputy after giving him his driver's license and then led him on a five mile pursuit that was eventually terminated. Sources say the deputy went to his home address listed on his license and met with his parents. Martinez subsequently turned himself in on that case. Both he and Passmore are now out on bond in this week's pursuit. In the Cypress area, Micah Hatfield, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.